Hey, this is Edward and Sam from The Ventables with a product showcase video of our family of up 3D printers. And our huge selection of PLA and ABS filament. It's huge. This is the Upplus 3D printer. Uh, it has an open frame style, an open build platform, uh, 200 cubic millimeter total build area. It takes both ABS and PLA filament, 1.75 millimeter, has a heated bed, and retails for about $1,500. And this is the Up Mini. And what I love about this printer is I think it's one of the first uh, desktop 3D printers that looks like it could be a coffee machine, it could be on your desk, it could be on in your kitchen counter. Uh, it could probably really fool people into thinking that. Do not, do not put coffee in that machine. It is not a coffee maker. It is not a coffee maker. Um, but it is a 3D printer and it is $899. So for under $1,000, um, you can have this printer that actually has the same build platform as the Up Plus. So uh, don't let the name Up Mini fool you. Um, and basically, the main difference between the two machines, they have the same print quality. Um, they would take about the same time to print the same part. The main difference is that it has this heated chamber. And the heated chamber is pretty cool. Uh, the idea behind it is to basically keep the temperature inside the machine, like around the print area, consistent, uh, which many people believe leads to uh, higher quality prints and or more consistent printing in terms of um, avoiding failed prints. Yeah, so I, I really love this printer. Um, and what's nice about both the printers is that they both come with a free half kilogram of white ABS, um, and they come with the uh, the cord, the, the USB cord, and you can plug it into your computer. Yeah, um, the software is free. You download it uh, from the website. It works on both Mac and PC, uh, which we've used it on both, and yeah. it's basically the same software. Um, the, I think the best thing about both of these is the fact that we literally took them out of the box and assembled them, which basically meant like snap the extruder on, um, and then plug them in, and they worked. But we were printing easily within 30 minutes of cutting the tape on the top of the box. Yeah, and they come with everything you need um, to start printing right away. Yeah. Um, and if you get tired of the white ABS that it comes with, um, we have a huge selection of both PLA and ABS filament that uh, 0.175. So it would, every film that we have will print on these machines and most other um, FDM printers. Yeah, basically any 3D printer that doesn't take one of those cartridge style um, filament spool things. Like if your printer just takes filament, one puts out the five millimeter, this will work. Yeah. And what's really great is we have pastel colors, we have fluorescent colors, um, we have natural, forest, black and white. This one's called green. It looks pretty great. <laughs> it's great. It, uh, I get it. That was pretty good. Yes. Uh, didn't you tell me that you can dye the natural one? Is that true? Um, yeah, so I have printed some stuff in natural, and you can actually, once the print is done, uh, just drop um, your part into like a cup of like a cheap fabric dye, um, and it'll, it, it doesn't look as nice as if you actually printed a color, but if you're trying to match a specific color uh, yes. could be a it's bright. That is bright. It's a I think it's neon green. Yeah. Neon green. So I don't have anything else. Do you have anything else? Uh, I don't think so. Alright. Take care. Bye. Bye. It's trying to stack that up. I can't do so. Sam, are you